In a world obsessed with instant gratification and fleeting trends, there exists a man who has defied the odds, amassing a fortune that dwarves the GDP of many small nations. His name is Warren Buffett, and his wisdom on matters of money is as timeless as the principles of compound interest. Today, we delve into the depths of Buffett's financial philosophy, uncovering 10 money habits that are keeping you broke and poor. These are not mere platitudes or recycled cliches, but rather insights gleaned from a life dedicated to understanding the intricacies of wealth creation. So if you're tired of living paycheck to paycheck, yearning for a future where financial freedom reigns supreme, then prepare to have your mind blown. Because what you're about to discover is not just a collection of tips and tricks, but a roadmap to a life of abundance. Rule 1. Living beyond your means. Imagine sailing a boat on a vast ocean. The allure of distant shores beckons, promising untold riches and unbridled joy. But if you load your vessel with more cargo than it can bear, you'll soon find yourself floundering, adrift in a sea of debt. This is the perilous path of living beyond your means. It's a seductive trap that ensnares countless individuals, lulling them into a false sense of security with its promises of instant gratification. But the reality is far harsher. When you spend more than you earn, you're essentially mortgaging your future, trading away your freedom for fleeting pleasures. Warren Buffett, the Oracle of Omaha, has long warned against the dangers of living beyond one's means. He famously said, if you buy things you don't need, soon you'll have to sell things you need. In other words, when you succumb to the allure of consumerism, you're putting yourself at the mercy of creditors. You become a slave to the whims of the market forced to work tirelessly just to keep your head above water. But there is another way. By choosing to live below your means, you gain control of your financial destiny. You free yourself from the shackles of debt and create a foundation for a lasting prosperity. So if you're tired of feeling trapped in a cycle of spending, it's time to take a hard look at your lifestyle. Identify areas where you can cut back and start living within your means. It may not be easy at first, but the rewards are well worth the effort. Remember, true wealth is not about owning the most expensive things, but about having the freedom to live life on your own terms. And that freedom begins with living below your means. Rule 2. Not having a budget? In the realm of personal finance, a budget is akin to a compass guiding you through the treacherous terrain of financial decision-making. Without one, you're like a shit lost at sea aimlessly drifting from one impulsive purchase to the next. Creating a budget is simple. Track your income and expenses, identify areas where you can cut back, and allocate your money accordingly. Once you have a budget in place, stick to it religiously. It's the only way to ensure that your spending is aligned with your financial goals. Buffett himself is a firm believer in the power of budgeting. He once said, the budget is not just a tool for tracking your spending. It's a statement of your values. In other words, your budget is a reflection of what's important to you. If you're spending more money on dining out than on savings, then your budget is telling you that you value immediate gratification over long-term security. So take some time to create a budget that reflects your values. And once you have a budget in place, stick to it. It's the only way to ensure that you're making sound financial decisions that will lead to a brighter future. Rule 3. Not investing... In the realm of personal finance, investing is akin to planting seeds. You nurture them with care and patience, knowing that they will eventually blossom into a bountiful harvest. But if you neglect to plant seeds, you'll never reap the rewards of a bountiful harvest. Similarly, if you don't invest, your money will simply sit there, losing value to inflation. Buffett is a firm believer in the power of investing. He has said the stock market is a device for transferring money from the impatient to the patient. In other words, those who are willing to wait for the long-term rewards of investing will be rewarded handsomely, while those who are impatient and seek instant gratification will likely miss out on the opportunity to build significant wealth. So start investing today. Even if it's just a small amount, over time, the power of compound interest will work its magic and you'll be amazed at how much your money can grow. Rule 4. Not taking advantage of tax-advantaged accounts the government offers a variety of tax-advantaged accounts that can help you save money on your taxes. These accounts include 400 TAMs, IRS, and HSA. By contributing to these accounts, 
you can reduce your taxable income, which can save you a significant amount of money. So if you're not taking advantage of tax-advantaged accounts, you're leaving money on the table. Buffett himself is a firm believer in the power of tax-advantaged accounts. He has said if you're not using tax-advantaged accounts, you're shooting yourself in the foot. So take some time to learn about the different types of tax-advantaged accounts available to you and start contributing to them today. It's one of the smartest financial decisions you can make. Rule 6. Not having a financial plan. In the realm of personal finance, a financial plan is akin to a roadmap guiding you through the treacherous terrain of financial decision-making. Without one, you're like a hiker lost in the wilderness, aimlessly wandering from one impulsive decision to the next. Creating a financial plan is simple. Identify your goals, assess your current financial situation, and develop a strategy for achieving your goals. Once you have a financial plan in place, you can make sound financial decisions that are aligned with your goals. Buffett himself is a firm believer in the power of financial planning. He has said, the best way to predict the future is to create it. In other words, by taking the time to create a financial plan, you are taking control of your financial destiny. You are no longer at the mercy of chance or circumstance. Instead, you are charting a course towards a brighter financial future. So take some time to create a financial plan that works for you. And once you have a financial plan in place, stick to it. It's the only way to ensure that you are making sound financial decisions that will lead to a brighter financial future. Rule 7. Not educating yourself about money. In the realm of personal finance, knowledge is power. The more you know about money, the better equipped you will be to make sound financial decisions. But if you don't take the time to educate yourself about money, you're putting yourself at a disadvantage. You're essentially handing over the reins of your financial future to others. So take some time to learn about personal finance. Read books, articles, and blog posts. Listen to podcasts and watch videos. The more you know, the less likely you are to make costly mistakes. Buffett himself is a voracious reader. He has said, best investment you can make is in yourself. So invest in yourself by educating yourself about money. It's one of the best things you can do for your financial future. Rule 8. Not being patient. In the realm of personal finance, patience is a virtue. Building wealth takes time. It's not a get-rich-quick scheme. But if you're not patient, you're likely to give up before you achieve your goals. You'll become discouraged by the slow pace of progress and abandon your efforts altogether. So remember, Rome wasn't built in a day. And neither is wealth. Be patient, stay focused, and keep working towards your goals. Buffett himself is a testament to the power of patience. He has said the stock market is a device for transferring money from the impatient to the patient. In other words, those who are willing to wait for the long-term rewards of investing will be rewarded handsomely, while those who are impatient and seek instant gratification will likely miss out on the opportunity to build significant wealth. So be patient, stay focused, and keep working towards your financial goals. Rule 9. Not taking risks. In the realm of personal finance, taking risks is essential for achieving great things, but too many people are afraid of taking risks, so they settle for mediocrity. They choose the safe and predictable path, even if it means sacrificing their dreams. But if you want to achieve anything worthwhile, you have to be willing to take risks. Buffett himself is a firm believer in taking risks. He has said, the biggest risk of all is not taking any risk. In other words, the greatest risk you can take is to play it safe, because by doing so, you are guaranteeing that you will never achieve anything truly great. So don't be afraid to take risks. Step outside of your comfort zone and pursue your dreams. Even if you fail, you will learn valuable lessons that will help you succeed in the future. Rule 10. Not focusing on value. In the realm of personal finance, value is king. It's the difference between getting a good deal and getting ripped off. But too many people focus on price instead of value. They are lured by the siren song of low prices without considering the quality of the goods or services they are buying. Buffett himself is a firm believer in focusing on value. He has said price is what you pay, value is what you get. In other words, it's not how much you pay for something that matters, but how much value you get from it. So next time you're making a purchase, don't just focus on the price. 
take the time to consider the value of the goods or services you are buying and make sure that you are getting the best possible value for your money. By following these 10 rules, you can avoid the money habits that are keeping you broke and poor, and you can start building a brighter financial future for yourself and your family. Remember, the key to financial success is not about making quick gains or getting rich quick schemes. It's about making sound financial decisions that will lead to long-term prosperity. So be patient, stay focused, and keep working towards your financial goals. With time and effort, you will achieve the financial freedom you desire.